Ho ho, my hearties. A very good evening to you. It's just me, Scotty McClue. I thought I'd pop up and just say hi, see what's happening with you. Fantastic stuff. Thursday night, and uh, it's just coming up to six minutes past ten o'clock. Six minutes past ten on the 16th of June 2022. And always good to have you with us and to say hi and dinky do. Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten to tell ten that Scotty McClue is live. The big man is live on TikTok just for you to say hi and a very, very warm welcome. Hello. Hello, Rick. How lovely to have you with us. And dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. Lots and lots of things happening and uh, so much to talk about and so little time to do it in. This is always the problem. Yes, indeed. Absolutely fantastic. Nice to see you all joining us. Uh, no sound, says Murray. Aha, Murray. That's something we need to sort right away. No sound, I say. Let's find out what's actually happening there, uh, and see if we can get that sorted out for you. Uh, I'm just wondering why we have no sound, though, because that's no good. You see, if you can't hear me, that's no good, I say to you. So let's see if we can sort that out for you. Right, we've got all of that. That's absolutely fine. And um, we'll see what's happening. There should be some sound for you. This is what I find very strange. Let me just see what's happening. Uh, right, so I've got that there. That's fine. And uh, we'll see what else we can do for you here. A uh, little bit of audio. Yes, indeed. Now then, let's see if we can get that sorted out for you. Bit of sound now, would you say? Is that better? Excellent. Lovely, lovely. Can you hear us now? That's what we need to know. Uh, do let us know. Nothing says Murray. Anything now, Murray? There we are. Neil says we can't hear you. Can you hear me now? Uh, wonderful. Yes, ah, there we are. That's excellent. Good. A very, very good evening to you, of course. Sorry about that. We had a little sound problem there. It's going to be even hotter tomorrow, says Angela. Yes, indeed. A very warm one uh, tonight and tomorrow, of course. Uh, 96 in Indiana, says Rick. Wow, Indiana wants me. But I can't go back there, as the old song says. Yeah, says Robert. Can you get it now, Robert? I don't know what was wrong there. But anyway, at least we've got some sound loud and clear. Excellent, Neil. That's what we like. We like to be loud, and we like to be clear. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, can you say something as you'd say on the radio? Oh, Apollo. What would I say on the radio? A warm welcome to Scotty McClure's phone in just for you, dinky do. Uh, I'm back after a year. Hello, Scotty. Remember you, Carl Carlos Donnelly. How could I ever forget you? So lovely to have you with us. And back after a year, we like that. Yes, indeed. Yes, I can hear you, says David. Wonderful. Will we sound problem at the start, David? And uh, we seem to have sorted it. It's my birthday at the end of the month. Can I get an early happy birthday? You can, Lewis. So what does that make you? Does that make you in star signs uh, a cancer? Something like that. Uh, so there we have it. Fantastic. Uh, Apollo, are you testing me to see if it's genuinely Scotty McClure saying dinky do to every single one of you? Fantastic. That's what it's about. Now then, lots to discuss. I've put up some new videos with the announcement this week that Scotland's going to go for another indie ref. I thought it was worth me getting my top and said, yes, cancel, says Lewis. Absolutely, Lewis. Good for you. Follow us as soon as you can. Uh, we need lots and lots of followers tonight. So as soon as you can, get following Scotty McClue and get checking out all the latest videos on TikTok and on YouTube. Tremendous. I put up one of the squirrel, and I think 500 of you have had a wee look. Is that not just amazing? Thank you do from David. David, lovely to have you with us. Feel free to give us a phone if you would like to. I'll just check that the phones are working, and then uh, we can get you coming on there as well if you would like. There we have it. Yes, excellent. That seems to be fine. Good. Wonderful stuff we've got. Phone's working. Scotty, do you have your milk delivered or do you buy it from the supermarket? 
Well, I buy it sometimes from the supermarket or from the shop. So there we are, because obviously you can do a lot of supermarketing, but it's nice to have the shop. I used to live in a village and I loved going to the different shops. Excellent point about retaining the monarchy as part of the independence debate. Well, Murray, I think this is vital because um, the nationalist movement was perceived as being republican and it was per perceived, this is the 1930s we're talking, as being too pro-Catholic. Now, in Scotland, that's very divisive. I mean, I wouldn't say it matters at all. As we've said before, you know, Catholic and Protestant are exactly the same religion. Everyone who is Christian is Catholic. They're just not necessarily Roman Catholic if they have protested. So that's that side of it. But I mean, we've never heard religion come up in the independence movement. But I know that it's very, very important that you can split the parliaments, but you never, ever, ever meddle with the crown. And that's the important bit. Love from Sonny Camber's Lang, says Robert. How are you? First Lord of the Internet from Australia. There's Frank, Frank Meyer. Frank, always lovely to hear from you and a big dinky do. All those old electric milk floats ahead of their time. They were, do you remember them? But I think they needed a fair bit of power and they didn't exactly swing along. You could hear them coming five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Scotty, where in Scotland are you from? From the West Coast. There you have it, a West Coaster. Wonderful stuff. But I just say, when people say, where in Scotland are you from? I say, all of it. Wonderful stuff. Now, good evening, Scotty. Joe, good evening to you. Are you ready to go to Rwanda, Joe? What I've been saying today, guys, it's caused horror and shock. The British government's idea that um, when you get illegal immigrants coming across in boats, um, we are going to fly them out to Rwanda and let the Rwanda process them now. I've actually been toying with a lot of ideas like this for years. And what I've come up with is what about our pensioners send them to India and Africa? Because with the cost of living crisis and Brexit, which has caused untold damage, the Brexiteers won't admit it, but it has. It's caused untold damage to our economy. And I notice people try to steer clear of it. They go, oh, there are other influences, but they don't say, well, of course, Brexit's caused untold damage. Um, and uh, with that sort of stuff, the pensioners are going to have a rough ride. And I thought if they were out in a hot country with good nourishing food and uh, able to keep warm, they didn't have bills for heating things like that, that would be a good move. So instead of maybe just if we, you know, if the courts rule that we can't send the illegal immigrants to Rwanda, what about our pensioners, UK pensioners, going to Rwanda? Are we fishing village in the Clyde? Absolutely, Murray O'Donnell. There are many fishing villages on the Clyde and on the Scottish lochs. I can tell you. There we are. You sound like the guy out of Still Game from the Shooting Estate episode. Thank you, Dylan. They always say Scotty McClue was the original inspiration for Still Game. Amazing. Rwanda just discovered one and a half million tons of gold. Should the UK invade and steal it? I don't think we'd be allowed to nowadays. I don't think we're strong enough just to go and steal it. But it used to make me laugh. When people said Africa is such a poor country and India is such a poor country. They're the richest countries in the world. They just need to uh, get what's below the ground up. There we are. Scotty McClure, Dinky Do, Carrot. How lovely to have you with us. Geodog says, Good day, Sir Scotty. Fantastic stuff. Uh, Dinky Do, Scotty, I've missed your show. Beachy, Beachy, it's lovely to be back with everyone for a wee chat. We're only up for a few minutes, you know what I mean? Maybe another 20 minutes or something like that. Hi, Scotty. Hello, Jerry. Lovely to have you with us. Excellent. But thanks, Murray, for picking up on the monarchy point. I think it's very important. Uh, good day to 